Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a new email subscription type on HubSpot. Subscription types are designed to accurately capture your contact's email subscription preferences. Rather than relying solely on opt-out functionality, email subscription types captures three states to more clearly represent a contact's consent to communicate with your business. For each subscription type, contacts may have opt-in, not opt-in or out, which is the default, or have opted out. Unless a contact explicitly requests to opt-in into a specific subscription type, they'll be added to your account with a not opted in or out status. Subscription types can be assigned manually to individual contacts in bulk from the contacts dashboard or via API. So let us walk you through how to create a new email subscription type. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Log in to your HubSpot account first. That's www.hubspot.com. Once you're in, click the settings cog at the top right to access HubSpot settings. Click the marketing dropdown and select email on the dropdown. Click the Subscription Types tab on top on the email page. You should see the list of subscription types available. Click the orange Create Subscription Type button to create one. Name your subscription. This can be any name that you want. Enter a brief description of how the subscription type will be used. Check the active checkbox if you want to launch the subscription type right away or uncheck it if you want it on standby. As you can see, that the preview field will auto-populate with a subscription name and the description. It is up to you if you want to change this, but this is the text that your customers see on the communication preference page. Lastly, click the orange finish button below to create a new email subscription type. You should see the new subscription type on top. If you wanted to make this active, hover your mouse to the subscription type and click the edit button. The same window will pop up. Check the active button and click the finish button to make it active. So that's it. That is how you create a new email subscription type on HubSpot. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.agency and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!